the JPS Foundation and the eDrive team. We are back at school today for Girls in ICT Day because we are encouraging and inspiring our girls to soar in STEM. So in honor of Girls in ICT Day for 2024, Project eDrive has partnered with the STEM Builders Learning Academy to execute an event at St. George's Primary and Infant School in Jamaica. It is actually the only all-girls school in Jamaica and the Eastern Caribbean. We're doing this because we realize the importance of STEM education in the development of the e-mobility ecosystem. It is true that it is through innovation that the e-mobility space will work. And so what we did today was to have the girls be introduced to electricity and also to circuits and understanding how a car is built. So we bro broke it down to their level. Today was such a fabulous day. It was so interesting to see the different personalities coming out because we gave each group, we had several groups, we gave them their own kits to work through and to build their e-vehicle. And we saw different challenges coming out. We saw the leaders that were dominant. We saw those that were jostling to just figure it out. And when they had a problem, some wanted to give up, but we were encouraging them to have patience, find the solution, work it out. I learned a thing or two, believe me. Hi, my name is Avoya. I am 11 years of age, and I go to the St. George's Girls Primary and School. If I could describe the activities that I did today in three words, it was nice. It was very fun actually. When my car started to move, it went back way at first. It was reversing. But then I did a few steps, a big step. It started working. Hi, I'm Courtney and I go to St. George's Girls Primary and Infant School. Today we built a car, it was very fun and it was running and we used technology to build the car. Hi, I am Mrs. Joseph Winter Hines, grade 6 coordinator at St. George's Girls Infant and Primary School. We decided to host the workshop because the girls need the exposure in the whole STEM because remember we are going technology with everything so as a result we wanted the girls to be exposed and we are happy that you guys could be here with us today. Most of our girls, they are exposed to the outer world because now you have TikTok, you have all kinds of social media platforms. So when it comes to being gender biased, these girls are really not affected. They are not affected and they will tell you that I want to go to a co-head um, high school or I want to remain in my comfort zone as it is among the same sex. But in terms of a career, these girls go all out. They go all out. So what you use electricity to do? Power your devices, right? You power all your electronic devices. You, you get it, you use it to get light, so it powers your light bulb. What else? So your fan, your refrigerator, your tablet, your phone, and of course, she said your Wi-Fi. She learned that we use technology and electricity to do things in our everyday life and that was a good takeaway from this morning what did you learn you learned how to be an engineer so we have budding engineers here so for the winning team for each member of the team we have a kit for them to take home and complete and also as i told you everybody needs to make sure that the cars that you built today, you are able to take them home to show your parents. 